The Department of Agriculture is facing a scandal over experiments on animals. Some of the tests reportedly included feeding potentially infected dead kittens to healthy ones. The scientists spent more than $20 million to buy cats and dogs from abroad for the experiments. <laughs> The Agricultural Research Service says it conducts experiments to strict ethical standards. They're researching a toxoplasmosis, a parasitic infection that some scientists believe could affect half the world's population. Cats play a significant role in its spread. We spoke to Justin Goodman from the organization behind the report. He shared some details of the gruesome testing. We were reviewing federal reports that contain uh, basically just a count of how many animals are at each laboratory in the United States. And we saw at the USDA there were several cats listed uh, being used, but no other information about what their use involves. So we submitted a Freedom of Information Act request, and we're able to get some details initially about the fact that the USDA is breeding 100 kittens a year, feeding them parasite-infected meat, collecting their feces for two weeks, and then incinerating the cats even though they're perfectly healthy and adoptable. We're actually in the middle of a lawsuit uh, to obtain documents about this research because obviously now that we know they've been going around the world and rounding up uh, dogs and cats from meat markets and people's pets, killing them and feeding them to cats in these kitten cannibal experiments, they don't want people to know about that and it seems like they've gone to great lengths to keep this project a secret. Last September, Congress issued a resolution calling for improvements in animal protection, but Mr. Goodman again thinks that is just an example of the government's hypocrisy. We found it incredibly hypocritical that while the U.S. government is taking steps to not only ban cat and dog meat here in the States, um, but also condemn nations that are doing it abroad, uh, the U.S. government was sending people over and sending money over to these countries and subsidizing these very cat and dog meat farms and markets uh, that Congress is so disgusted with and that virtually everyone in America wants uh, to see ended. Um, so it's incredibly ironic and hypocritical. Uh, and I think that is a testament to the incredible lack of accountability at the USDA, um, where on one hand you have the entire nation working to stop a practice that the USDA is helping keep alive. Truth is, is that virtually any experiment on animals in the United States is legal as long as the right paperwork is filled out. Thank <laughs> you.